Hey guys, Dr. Ben here, F8 Well Center. Should you be taking Ozempic, Manjaro, Wagovi, any of these weight loss, weight loss medications, uh, if you've got, if you've got thyroid issues, if you've got hypothyroidism, well, here's the deal. 80 to 90% of women that have hypothyroid actually have Hashimoto's. Hashimoto's is actually an autoimmune disease. So if you have an autoimmune disease, should you be taking a drug that can drive your blood sugar really low? that can cause hypoglycemia, well, here's the deal. We know physiologically, every time your blood sugar spikes up, every time your blood sugar crashes down, you are going to rev up the immune re response and you're gonna destroy more tissue. So if you are not type two diabetic, if you are not pre-diabetic or blood sugar high all the time, I would seriously consider not taking that medication. But here's the deal. All you have to do is track your glucose, either fingerprint glucose monitor or a continuous glucose monitor. And this is what we do with every one of our patients. And so we're able to see exactly why that blood sugar goes up, why it's going down. If it's crashing down on Ozempec, if you are crashing down, you are revving up and destroying more tissue. So what do you need to do? You need to track your blood sugar. You may take the, one of these drugs and it may be okay and your blood sugar may not crash. You may not go hypoglycemic. I'd be surprised, especially if you have autoimmune disease. Almost every patient that we work with that has autoimmune, that blood sugar spikes up, that blood sugar crashes down, and you've got to get it stabilized 85 to 110 all day, every day.